All right, time now for a look at the forecast. For that, we're going to go back to McClovio's living room. Hey, Mac. <laughs> Hey, good morning, everybody. Uh, the coffee's ready. Would you like some? <laughs> this is what they call social distancing. So we got to do what we got to do. Well, good morning, everybody. If you are along the coastal waters, uh, you've got some very dense fog to deal with this morning. Take a look at our weather bug camera over at Padre Island. You can see the soupy weather out there. It's uh, quite warm. And uh, right now, it looks like the fog is just along the immediate coastline. 72 degrees. And of course, uh, hardly a wind right there. It's reporting north at three, but it's, it's hardly a breeze out there. And that's why the fog is rolling in from the immediate uh, coastline. Now, obviously, yesterday we did get a little bit warmer, didn't get much sunshine, and today we're going to get even warmer with no opportunity for any sunshine. Here's a look at our visibility is right about now. You can see we've got a quarter mile down at Naval Air Station at the airport, zero up in Rockport, so uh, everybody up from 281 to the coast needs to be very careful as you... Um, march al along the roadways there of course now most people have to stay uh, at home and hopefully that uh, it will be the situation minimizing any kind of problems here's a look at our satellite view and you can see the cloud deck that's over us what uh, we're do doing again is what we did a couple of weeks ago strong high pressure is on top of us and this layer of very uh, dense moist air is right on top of us so we're not going to be able to blow through that uh, inversion as a result we're going to be on the very cloudy and warm side today but as we take a look at the big picture again i want to point out to that storm out in california it's a very late season storm but it is definitely a winter storm out there and that system will be affecting your weather giving us a very good chance for some stormy weather late in the week this week as a matter of fact let's take a look at it on weather um, our future pattern here we're looking at of course high pressure over us it's going to drop down into the Gulf slowly but surely that storm on the West Coast is going to start moving toward us by Wednesday it starts moving into the state Thursday late probably into Friday morning it will pass over the area and then the remnants of that system will be overhead and so we've got a very good chance for getting additional showers around here on uh, Friday and decreasing on Saturday. Sunday I believe that we will start clearing up and uh, should be a little bit nicer weather for Sunday but then again, you know, it is Easter Sunday and we're just not going to be able to do much. So we're calling it very warm and very muggy for the next couple of days. Rain chance begins Thursday night into Friday morning. And then by Saturday, uh, it should start pulling away. Sunday, I believe, should be a little bit better of a day as we get to more seasonal weather for this time of year. So other than the fog, do watch out uh, if you happen to be driving. Otherwise, if you happen to be in your living room watching the news, well, have another cup of coffee and I'll see you back in a little bit. Back to you, Mike. All right, pretty good advice. Thank you, Mac.